Hi, it's Mary Terry. I'm coming to you because um, it's going to be Halloween really soon. And I really do not like Halloween because I do not like the winter. And I know that sounds ridiculous because Halloween is far from the winter. But it means that the winter is coming. So I was at the Christmas store. Okay, I hate the winter, but I love Christmas. I know this is all just very strange. Um... I was at the Christmas store and um, I saw this pumpkin, this big pumpkin, but much bigger than the pumpkin that you see here. Well, this is a pumpkin if you can't tell. It's a pumpkin <laughs> with flowers on it. But I saw a bigger one there that was really pretty, but it was like $19.99. And I thought, well, it's like a pumpkin with flowers on it. I have flowers that I've made. A lot of flowers that I've made and I had I can probably buy a pumpkin somewhere like at Joann's or at Michael's and no I found this one at the dollar store it was you know a tinier pumpkin but it does the trick and what I did is I just put flowers all around it and I got these uh, picks at the dollar store too and so which is picks it just kind of highlight the um, stem because the stem kind of gets hidden by this little black flower so anyway, that's one of the projects that I made. And then the good news, big news I have, is that this is so exciting. I have to share it. Um, Ron DeLay, little Ron DeLay on YouTube, and I have been like, we've been YouTube friends for a really long time. And we like each other very well. And we've like Skyped with each other. And we've like emailed with each other. And we've talked on the phone a gazillion times. And we've shared a lot of stuff with each other and she just feels like a, a bestie to me and uh, I hope she feels the same way but she was talking about going to Ontario <clears throat> to, to this scrapbook expo and that she and a couple other YouTube gals were going to go and I was like boy I wish I could go and uh, of course She's originally from Canada. I think she was born in Canada. I'm not quite sure. I don't know. But I know she spent some you know, some of her youth in Canada. So I was putting together Ontario with Canada. Although she lives in California, I was still putting it together with Canada because it's right above me because I'm on the East Coast. And she's on the West Coast, Rhonda. So I'm hoping. And I didn't know there was an Ontario, California. So last night, I was just talking about putting some stuff together for her birthday and I was telling Rich about the fact that they were doing that and he said well, why aren't you going to go with them and I was like because it's like you know and he's like well let's just look at it I'm like you know what I could probably do it so I call her and I'm like hey and she's like really and I'm like yeah I think I might be able to go and she said well um, and I said, so where can I, where in Ontario are you going to be? Like in Toronto? She's like, no, Tara. She's like, it's Ontario, California. I'm like, oh, snap. I was so upset. I was like, what? So anyway, long story short, I figured out a way to get to California. Okay, I'm going to California. Okay, California, here I come. And I wish that all, wait, what's the song? Wish they all could be California girls. I don't know. I'm from Pennsylvania. What do I know? All right, so that's my big news. I'm going with the I'm going with the gals, the gals that I've never met before, but it's gonna be really cool. Um, and then I just wanted to show you this other quick little book that I made. It was a DiGiorno pizza box that I painted, and um, I watched this crazy thing that I bought from something called Interweave on the internet called interweave and it's like cloth paper scissors as part of it or whatever but they had this five dollar sale and I got this DVD or no I got a download of a video that was like an hour and maybe an hour and 45 minutes long with this woman on it that was like cool and she was talking about making backgrounds and painting and general and color theory and all kinds of things I, I can't remember it but I'll try to link it below but in any case she made this bunch of different books with different bindings that she called no sew bindings and although I kind of think this is sewing it's not your traditional sewing on a sewing machine or you know pamphlet stitch or whatever but what you do is you take your pages that I made out of the journal boxes I cut them up into similar sizes not perfect they don't have to be perfect 
and I put straps on them. And what you do is you lie, lay, lie. Somebody help me out because I'm not a great, I'm not good with that. That's the one thing. I, I'm educated, but lay and lie. You lie via book it down or the covers that you want down. And let me show you the way I was looking at it. And then what you do is you attach straps. And I just took this pretty ribbon that my girlfriend gave to me, Nicole, who used to work with me. She got me all this beautiful pink ribbon, and I really get rarely get to use it. And I thought it was a pretty cool juxtaposition to the background. And then what you do is you take and you put holes in the next page, and then you tie little ribbons only about this long through those holes and then into and around the straps so that you end up with this thing and it was a really fun book to make and I really enjoyed the binding and I'm going to try to find this woman's at least this woman's name I don't know how to link things so I don't know why I even said I could link it because I'm technologically challenged um, sometimes when it comes to this YouTube Thank you very much for watching, you guys. I hope everybody's doing very well. And apparently, um, we're going to be at a scrapbook expo in um, Ontario, uh, California, not Canada, even though it's CA. And uh, please, please, I guess, call Rhonda. She, it's on her channel, too. If you if you watch her or go to her, little Rhonda Lee, and she's got her cell phone number listed if you, like, email her or something. So you could meet up with us. We'd love that. Bye. I'll be watching your videos soon. Thanks again for watching.